morning, neighborhood community. Morning. I just woke up. I've been sleeping on and off for days now. So I just woke up a little while ago. Kevin made me wake up and take my medications. And uh, now I'm in a lot of pain. <laughs> and uh, there's not much I can do about it. I take the medications and I try and take them very sparingly. I don't like to take the meds. The pain meds especially. Yeah. I don't like you taking them either. I don't like taking pain meds. But um but if I didn't take the pain meds right now I mean the pain is pretty difficult to deal with. If I didn't take the pain meds it would be unbearable to deal with. Yeah. So it's very difficult. Um I'm tired of sitting on the couch every day, day in and day out. I want to get outside, I want to go somewhere, but I can't walk. So, and my wheelchair basically is falling apart. So, we are on the lookout for a nice wheelchair or a, a pretty nice electric wheelchair. So, if we can afford it. If we can afford it or if we can find someone that could donate one. Um, go to a church or something and look for some or some I don't know um, but we gotta try and find something because I need to get out of this house I'm going stir crazy and I don't mean get out of the house and go to the doctors or go to emergency or go to urgent care I want to get out and go do something mm -hmm. so so um, as we had mentioned yesterday we are broke yeah we're very broke we're beyond broke we're past broke um, and we're selling the house um, our real estate agent says it looks good. It's coming. She's coming over Friday. She, yeah, it'll be next Friday, not tomorrow. But um, I don't know how quickly that's going to happen. But we are so broke, and uh, we're so broke. And my mother's been helping us that she has. We're taking her down with us, and I can't do that. Once we sell the house, though, we have a really nice place to go to. We do. Where? The nicest underpass we can find. Yeah, we could find a nice underpass. <laughs> be living in a million dollar home. But if they let us set up a tent, we'll have a tent. <laughs> but what we want to do, and this is something that we've never wanted to do. We've actually done it once before um, with limited success. And I don't care how limited success we have this time, but I need to get Val a CAT scan. Um, and if it shows something, we're going to need money if she needs surgery because it's going to cost us a lot of money. So we're... Even with my insurance. It's, that's with insurance. That we're going to ask, we're going to open a GoFundMe. And uh, we're going to ask for $1,000 and all that's going to go towards Val's medical, uh, including wheelchairs, if, if, if we get enough money to do that. So... I hate asking, um, I but we're kind of at our at the end of our rope here, so I don't know if the uh, handyman thing is ever going to take off because it's been it's been pretty dead uh, lately, and we're not getting all these companies that give us um, uh, what do you call them leads? leads? They want too much money. They're, they're, they charge you for the leads. Yeah, they're soaking us dry, and we're not make, getting enough leads out of any work out of the leads. So, we're not getting any help anywhere as far as that's concerned. So, I sorry we're doing this. Uh, I'm filling out all kinds of paperwork to um, to get help. Help. Uh, our biggest problem with getting any kind of help is we own a house. You know, we tried to um, declare bankruptcy, couldn't do it because we own a house. Can't get food stamps. Can't get food stamps. Well, those probably will be en ending soon anyway. Um, yeah, because I have equity. Val and I own a house that has value. So, and we've been holding on to it, holding on to it, because it's the only thing we have. And once we sell it, I still don't have an income, so we don't know what's going to happen after that. We realize most of you out there are in the same boat we are. Yeah. Um... Every little bit helps, even a dollar, even, you know, anything you can possibly give. Even a smile emoji would make us happier. Yeah, a smile emoji. Um, 
No poop emojis. Views, our subscribers on our neighborhood PIN channel. That will even help. <laughs> yeah, I'm very close to putting up another PIN. Yeah, so, um, again, we hate to ask, but I'm suffering, guys, and we could really use the help for that. What? So, where are you at in Walking Dead? I'm on season three already. Yay! Is that the is that a governor thing? Yes. I hated the governor season. I know you hated the governor seasons. I didn't like the governor season either because I hate the governor. <laughs> okay. But he dies at the, at the. It takes for it takes another season before he's dead. But that's okay. He dies. <laughs> but so do some other people that I really like. Mm hmm. I won't say any names in case anybody out there hasn't already seen it. Five or six times. I've only seen it, s well, this is my eighth time. So That's right, you do this every season. Actually, twice a season, so this is my 16th time. <laughs> I love The Walking Dead. I what know. am I going to do when the series is over? Watch something else. When they take it off the air. I don't have it on DVD. That's on my wish list, by the way. <laughs> yes, dear. Along with 50 million other coloring books. <laughs> <laughs> so, everybody. Sorry it's been another sad, boring vlog. Well, we haven't said anything about what's going on in Florida, either. No. That's, that's terrible. That's just, you know, it's been like 18 shootings just in the first two months of this year. Mm-hmm. So. It's not even two months. It's a month and a half. And there's been 18 shootings already. School shootings. Hmm. Right? I think that's the number. That's, it's outrageous. That's, that's terrible. Our hearts go out to... All the victims, all the families that have been affected by this shooting in Florida and by by every shooting and disaster and needless killing that goes on. And it's, it's just so hard to deal with and so hard to watch on the news and listen to the parents and even the news people are crying, and, yeah. and it's just really, really heart-wrenching. And it's hard for me to <laughs> sit here and, you know, think about my pain and, and complain about my pain when there's so many people out there suffering from stuff like that. Yeah. So, so but today I spent the whole day filling out applications online for medic. Cal, Medicaid, <laughs> something, I forget what it's all called, but this, the forms are just pages long, so it took most of the day to do that, so not much film today, um, didn't even get to work on the PIN that I said I was going to work on, uh, so what did you do today? I uh, slept most of the day, and I colored a little bit. And that's about it for me. Mm. But um, we did open up the GoFundMe that we talked about earlier today. And um, I don't know if we're going to be able to put an eye in the sky on this vlog, but it will be in the description. We also have it on the Neighbors Facebook page my personal Facebook page, which a lot of you already have. We have it on Kevin's Twitter, my Twitter, and even though it's not clickable, we do have it on my Instagram as well. Um, so you can always find it wherever you want to try and get to it from. And if, if you can afford something, you can afford something, and if you can't, then... No big you know. deal if you can't. Will you stop? Too many crickets. Hey, stop, stop. <laughs> I 
Okay. So, do you have anything else to add? No, not a thing. Okay, we're going to do our closer. You ready? Are you ready, little girl? Okay, <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and call it an evening. If you enjoyed a little bit of something that you may have seen in our video today, please give us a favorite. Please give us a thumbs up. Please leave a comment down below. Please share. Please share our video with your family and friends. I love you. I love you. I love you. See you tomorrow. I love you.